Hello, Earth. My name is Nick Blackley. I'm your Astro Gaming Research Program correspondent, and we're going to be spending a lot of time together. We were looking at our scans this morning, and we found this new game called The Outer Worlds. Space RPG. Uh, it's by Bethesda, not Bethesda. By the other guys, by Obsidian. So I have not played, not played anything, any of this. This will be blind, totally. Biggest question is whether we go hard or supernova. And I'm not sure. I'm not sure which one we want to do. So supernova mode adds additional challenges to the game. To reduce the difficulty, you can't re-enable it. Uh, enemies have more health and deal more damage. You have to eat, drink, and sleep. Companions die permanently. That one I'm a little worried about. Crippled body and limb conditions can only help you. Healed with bed rest, weapons and armor work very poorly, but zero durability, fine. It only fast travel to your ship, and sleep inside your ship, and only manually save while inside your ship, and auto saves are limited. That's pretty big. Um, you know what? I'm kind of feeling super over. I think we do it. We're in. Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier owned and operated by corporations. Press the button harder. There you go. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. All right. So we're in here. This is the game now. We gotta see what we can do. We've got three attributes. You know what? I think I'm gonna go Fastest with this. Fastest gun in Halcyon, or you will be once you get hold of a gun. I'll just do. I think this is, I think this is pretty good. Or maybe, here's the thing, is that we've studied Fallout New Vegas, and Fallout New Vegas has some interesting options if you are an idiot. You have this You're to below easily average. Brainwashed. Words are hard, thinking no good, dumb dialogue options unlocked. This is interesting, the dumb dialogue options. I mean, we could just go like a full on brute, bash their heads in sort of guy. That might be fun. That could be fun. Maybe we'll do that. Uh, maybe we will go lowest intelligence, high strength. Let's go ahead and hit next. Skills. Obviously, we're going to do melee. Um, our ability with long guns is three. We go stealth. If you wanted to steal yeah. from the rich, you've come to the right colony. Yeah, we're going to. Yeah, okay. Next. Aptitude. Hierarchy of a modern. They want to. Your role as assistant to the second deputy chef <laughs> is one of the middle is one of middling distinction, but you are honored to pour your heart into the ritual emptying of grease pans. I am a hundred percent going to be a chef. That is not really even a goddamn a question. I'm just a fucking dumb dinner? chef. Let's see what kind? Let's see what kind of damage we can do, huh? And then can I change like oh god. Alright, hold on. Let's let's find a face that we we wanna try to mess up here. So okay, let's go with this. Eye color. Vampire? Okay. Okay, let's go with the red. It kind of like constant look of surprise with that one. Oh! 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 Bow size. The huge nose. We have to intake a lot of air. Uh, nose tilt? <laughs> oh no! That's a crater! I have to 
facial hair. <laughs> Absolute snout. Yeah, he's got a big honky nose for sure. And I feel like this kind of accents this whole arrangement we've got going here. They're like a grease stain option. Kind of Mario looking mustache. Shit. We've made Mario, haven't we? Space Mario. Uh. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah. Okay, let's see. How similar, how similar are we looking here? <laughs> I'm not against Space Mario. <laughs> Maybe Space Mario's kind of a diva. Kind of liking the no makeup look. If we're given the option, I feel bad about not taking it. All right. I think that's good. I'm feeling that's that's pretty good. So here here's what I've, I'm thinking. I'm thinking that this is Space Mario. He's definitely a chef. Um, well, he's no, he was a chef. We're dumb as shit, and we're just going to run around and whack on people. Not whack off on people. Whack people. We already named it. Space Mario. Alright, so summary. Very high strength. We're a very strong man. We are extremely powerful, but still dexterous. Our muscles have not reduced our ability to use our fingers. Okay. The brain? The brain's really not super great. I think, uh, you know, trying to find a princess facing her around really has affected our intelligence poorly. Bad way. Perception. We can see, you know, we're not 2020, but we're good. Charm, we're as charming as a man who never speaks and only says wahoo is. And then the temperament is pretty good. All right, Space Mario.